Nobody tells you how hard this is. This is too much. Hello everyone and welcome to this video. So today is a very, I don't even know if I want to say exciting because I feel like I'm going to hate it halfway through. But today I am trying on all of the clothes that I own. Um, basically I am going to try on all the clothes in my closet. I'm not sure if I want to try on all the clothes that I own because to be honest, that could literally take forever. I also have way too many clothes. So we're gonna do that and I'm not sure how it's gonna go, but just keep watching. Okay, so we're here. This is my closet. Pretty decent. Um, I like kind of went through it not that long ago, but I feel like I should try things on because some of the stuff I kind of just kept just to keep. So I don't really know where to start. I guess, well, I am wearing one of the things that I own. This is just a, um, it was a Ralph Lauren like sweatshirt thing, but then I cropped it and I tie-dyed it. So I'm definitely keeping this because I just finished this and this is actually going to be in my like collective haul thing so you'll see it on there but this is one of the things i like it we're gonna keep okay so moving on we're just gonna start from like the back to the front mostly because some of these i don't have to like change for so i'm gonna put a tank top on and then i'm going to start putting these things on okay so i just put a tank top on um i'm keeping this tank top because i really like it so starting back here we have these two things i know i'm keeping so i'm not gonna try them on but they're just a like wrap thing I don't know I wear them all the time this one I like hang around the house with and this one's actually like more I can wear somewhere else so we're keeping that this guy I love oh my god nobody tells you how hard this is so this is my UB alumni sweatshirt I got it when I graduated as a gift and I love it it's one of my favorite hoodies I wear it all the time and it's super comfortable a little bit bigger for me so I like that so yeah this is a key okay next I also just got this and I'm keeping this because I got it from Walmart for like $9 I think. It's from the men's section, it's like the Fruit of Loom sweatshirts. Got it in a medium, it's super cozy and I think it's perfect for fall. So we're keeping this. So next we have this like Nike sweatshirt. Yeah, we're gonna keep this one on. Okay, we're back, we got jeans on, so. Moving on. Um, I have a few cardigans. <sighs> this one, like, I'm kind of struggling with. I, I think, no, I think I should keep this for, like, work outfits and stuff. It's not really my style anymore. Like, it's that kind of that, like, tighter cardigan look. Um, but it is, like, a little bit oversized. Okay, update. I literally put the mirror, I took the mirror off my wall and put it on my bed, so. <sighs> yeah, no, we're gonna keep this. I think it's a good, like, layering piece. It's very fall-like, I like the color. It actually doesn't look bad with this outfit, so we're gonna keep that. Okay, so next, another cardigan. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna keep this one too because, I don't know, I just, I feel like it's a good color. It's comfortable. It's also like nice enough that I could wear it to like a job. So we're gonna keep that as well. Next. I am definitely keeping this. I actually was gonna give it away and then I wore it with like a dress the other day and it looked so freaking cute. And you know when you've had something for a long time and you're like, well, I don't think I'm gonna wear that. But like, I think this is really cute. It's good for the summertime because it's like short sleeved. Also, if I keep looking this way, it's because the mirror is right there. But I'm definitely gonna keep this. It's just, I don't know. I think it's cute. Okay, these two, I'm not gonna try on because I know that I like them and they're the same thing. They're just two, it's a black cardigan, it's a gray cardigan, um, and I wear them for like work outfits, so we're keeping those. Alright, so, you know, I know I should keep this because I don't have that many zip-up jackets, and it's cute, it's lightweight, but this is a large. Like, I, this is a large from, where is it from? It's literally from Aeropostel. Got it freshman year of college. They were having a huge sale when we all thought they were going out of business and then they didn't. So I don't understand how this is a large. Kind of confused. Wait, is it a large? Yeah, it's a freaking large. Like, 
I don't know. Air pastel, let's like get on your sizing. I'm gonna keep this though. I think it's a good layering piece. Pretty light weight. Okay, we found something. My mom is going to be so sad that I'm giving this away because she literally got it for me. And I think it's really cute. It's just, I never wear it and it's not really my style. I'm gonna go with no. We're gonna, we're gonna give that to my mom. Next we have this guy. Let me tell you, it is one of my favorite sweatshirts. Thumbnail pick. I love this. I don't even care what people say. I think it's a really cute sweatshirt. We're keeping this. It's cute. I like it. Okay, we're gonna keep her. What are you? I'm gonna keep it. I'm like sweating. I just like, I don't know. I feel like it was my style a couple years ago when I was trying to look all like hip. And then I realized that like, it's just not me. I think it's actually, we're gonna keep it. We're gonna keep it. This is just, this is too much. This, I am pretty sure I'm gonna give a look. I don't know, you know, like it doesn't bring me joy. Also, I am a big not, I am not a big fan of these kind of sleeves. I am going to give this one away. This one I'm keeping, it's from American Eagle. It's like the softest shirt I own. It's super comfortable, I wear it all the time. So, I'm keeping that. This I also just got, um, not just, but it was like one of my like quarantine buys. And I think it would be cute with like a high waisted pair of work pants. For work, it's pretty soft. It's from Forever 21, I like it. Also this too, they're basically kind of the same thing, but this is like a sweatshirt to chill in and this is like work stuff. So yeah, we're gonna keep this. I'm exposing how much I bought over quarantine. I also bought this over quarantine. It's also super soft. It's also from Forever 21. So I'm keeping it. I'm just gonna pick out things that like I'm definitely keeping because I feel like that's redundant to try it on and be like I'm keeping it. So keep, keep. So talk about something I've had forever. I've had this since at least freshman year of high school, if not longer. The problem is, is like it's super soft. So I always thought like, oh, maybe I'll wear it. But A, when do I ever wear stripes? Not often. B, it's so tight on the arms and it's loose on top. We're gonna give that away. I put this on, realized that I haven't worn it in like three years, and then also realized how soft it was, so now I'm gonna keep it. These two shirts, I keep saving them because I'm like, well, maybe one day I'll wear them. Okay, well, I'm definitely getting rid of this one. But like, here's the thing I don't wear anything flowered. Yeah, no, we're getting rid of it. <gasps> Okay, well, this I'm keeping because I knew I was going to, um, but it has a freaking stain on it, so I'm gonna try to get that out. So this guy was my trusted, trusted shirt freshman year, my trusted going out shirt. We're gonna get rid of this one. Okay, so this is the point where I realized that this video was about to be like 30 minutes long, so I'm gonna start fast forwarding through this. these clothes back and then I'm going to like take out the boxes and start doing that. Okay so I think we're looking a little bit cleaner right? It's looking a little bit better. Okay so oh god we're moving on to sweatshirt. I just have so many and I just love them but you know what we're maturing and we are looking for clothes that aren't sweatshirts. Starting with this Yankee sweatshirt. 100% keeping this, first of all. Why would you even wonder? Next, we have this Penn State sweatshirt. We're also keeping this. We are giving away this. If it were just plain black, I would love it, but the whole like pink on the front, not a big fan of. Also, the sleeves are kind of tight. Oh, God. Yeah? What's up? I'm changing. What's up? Where? Um, yeah, so I'm not gonna keep this. 
I feel like I'm going to donate this. This sweatshirt I really enjoy wearing. It's just nice to like lounge around in. I'm going to keep this because this is like a souvenir that my mom got for me. I'm also going to keep this. Alright, so this is the moment where I kind of get sad because this is from Hilton Head Island. I never wear it and I have some other things from Hilton Head and I have pictures and my parents are moving there so we're gonna keep it. I mean we're gonna get rid of it. Not a Florida Gators fan. B, this is just a ridiculous hoodie and I'm going to get rid of it. This sweatshirt is from San Diego, we're gonna keep it. Oh, but this one's from San Diego. Okay, I'm gonna keep this and then I'm gonna see if my mom wants the pink one. Okay, so I have come to the executive decision that I am not going to get to everything today because this is already so long and like I don't even know how. I'm gonna edit this down to below 15 minutes. So I'm going to do my other box of sweatshirts and I think that's it. Okay, so my UV sweatshirt, love it, super soft, it's super oversized, that is being kept. My Puma sweatshirt, also oversized, comfortable, being kept. This is just a like burnt pink, is that a color? I don't know, anyways I wear this all the time, I like it. This is a Bill sweatshirt, which we're keeping, obviously. This is also a UV sweatshirt. I just can't get rid of it because I got it my freshman year of college and it just brings back so many memories and I wore it all the time and I still really like it, so. I know that this may not be the most fashionable item, but I love the fact that it is a lighter fit, gray sweatshirt that I can just lounge around in in the summer because it's not as hot, so. We're keeping this. Don't come at me. We have another Buffalo Bill sweatshirt, which we are keeping. This was thrifted. This was a very good thrift find. But I guess when you live in Buffalo, you can find a lot of Bill's apparel. What am I doing? But yeah, okay, we're keeping it. Okay, this is a San Francisco jacket. We're keeping that too. Um, this guy is super comfy. We're keeping this. Also this, this sweatshirt, this one, is from Sam's Club. We're keeping this. Lastly, I believe this is my uncle's who left this at our house and I never gave it back to him because I secretly wanted it. But I've worn it maybe twice. So we're gonna donate it. Okay. I think actually it's pretty good. So I've gotten rid of like this much stuff. Which I think, you know, in the grand scheme of things is actually a good amount. Okay, so I didn't even think about the sun coming through the window when I filmed this clip, but please disregard the fact that I look like a Casper the Friendly Ghost. Okay guys, so I hope you enjoyed this video. Um, it just took me a lot of time and like I was just kind of sweating during that because it was a lot. So I hope you enjoyed it. Um, if you didn't, I'm sorry, but if you did, thank you. And if you are at this point in the video, leave a comment down below saying like whether you've cleaned out your closet or your room during this quarantine because I feel like literally everyone has. So yeah, I think that's it for today and I will talk to you guys next time.